The aim of culture train is to bring South Sudanese all together in one place to participate in cultural activities, to understand each other through dance and music. You don't have to explain to someone who you are, but by the way you dance, the way you dress, the way you accept yourself is already an education to them. And through that one, we are able to build peace and unity among us as South Sudanese. Culture train, it has impacted many of the young youth in South Sudan through art. Uh, we preach peace through art and through music and through what we are doing. Because we are actually representing all the tribes of South Sudan through the art, through the dance, through uh, the dramas. We are not one tribe, they are different tribes forming one team to see South Sudan united as one. That culture thing in our mind, the tribalism, we really need to clean out from our mind. Come on, my turn, they see to eat a big of four bonnil. Come on, my turn, they see to South Sudan and in a go in. Yes, uh, most of us started from the same school, uh, we were in Jubade Secondary School. So when we joined drama and dance, we learned a lot. And from there, we built a um, relationship with people and among ourselves. We started for passion, we just want to be there, you know, these high school celebrities, because we want to be known, we want to be seen on stage. But we came to understand that this is actually more than ourselves, and we can actually give a lot to people through this. When she came to Juba, this way she called us, and uh, that's where we started uh, Culture Train. And when we look into Culture Train today, Culture Train, it has impacted many of the young youth in South Sudan. Uh, we preach peace through art and through music and through what we are doing. So when the idea of Culture Train came in, all the students, most of the students that we are in the same school, that year from 2011 to 2014, came together to support this idea because they know the power of art, music, in, in, in preaching peace and unity in the country. We are one and we preach peace. We are not for tribalism and we are for hope. Culture Fen, uh, our vision is to inspire communities to understand uh, peace through their cultural and traditions. And our vision is to promote peace and unity um, among South Sudanese. And the motto of Culture Fen says that our culture, our identity, meaning that we shall represent ourselves through culture. So in the future, I want to see that all South Sudanese youth, they are one and we are loving ourselves. And not only putting people, I mean, uh, putting smile on people's faces, but we need to see people understand the message that we want to pass. And for us to see a peaceful country, a peaceful community, it is more than one person effort. We need effort from the religious leaders, from the educational institutions, from the government bodies, from the NGOs bodies, to come together and see that this thing called peace is being fulfilled. We are always open for networking and partnerships. We are always open to different things because we are focused. Our main focus is to create peace. And to, to do that, we all need to come together to see that this country is peaceful.